السلام علیکم وعلیکم السلام و رحمۃ اللہ بٹ دا ہسبینڈ ڈزن وانٹ ٹو کین دا وومین اسٹل ڈیوس ود آؤٹ دا ہسبینڈ اوپینین ایز فار ایز طلاق ایز فار ایز ڈیوس از کنسرن بٹ نیچرل دا رائٹ ہیز بین گون جنرلی ٹو دا ہسبینڈ اینڈ دا پروسیجر ڈسکرائب ان دا قرآن But if the woman coffee, that means if she wants, she too can give a divorce unilaterally. And if it gets in the Nikah Nama, then it's possible she can also give. Because during Nikah Nama, any terms and condition can be mentioned by the husband, the would-be wife, as long as they are not demanding something which is haram or forbidding something which is fard. But Giving talaq is the prerogative given by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to the man, to the husband. But if she says, even I too can give unilateral divorce if I wish. And if the husband agrees during nikah, then if she give. So the condition where she can give unilateral divorce is if it's mentioned in the nikah nama. Point number one. Point number two, if it is not mentioned in the nikah nama, and if she wants a divorce, what she can do is she can request the husband that I don't want to continue with you, whether there may be reason, there may not be a reason, whatever it is. And if the husband agrees that though he wants to continue, but he agrees with the request of the wife and gives divorce, that is called as kola. Kola means the woman, the wife asks for divorce and the husband agrees and husband pronounces talaq. Though he doesn't want, but he agrees with the wishes of the wife on her request. And at this time, the woman may have to forgo her maher. Or if she has been given maher, she may have to return. If the husband doesn't want to take, that's his wish. But generally, if she requests for a divorce, the maher given by the husband has to be returned back. Or if it's not given, it need not be taken. This is the second option. The third option is that if the wife requests the husband for a divorce and the husband refuses to give divorce, as a last resort, she can go to a qazi, to a judge, and she will have to give the reasons why she wants to divorce. And if there is a legitimate reason, maybe she will say that he is not taking care of me, he is not providing me with the basic requirements of lodging, boarding, clothing, or he is hurting me, he is always torturing me. If there is a Sharia valid reason why she wants a divorce, or if the husband is not fulfilling his duties, or is torturing her, then if the judge Ask, that is nullify the marriage so this is the third option she has is no the wife is unjustified that the husband is giving her her due rights and taking care of her they feel that she is justified then she can go to a qazi to a judge and do nikai fask hope that answers the question